In tonight's Tech Minute, electric vehicles only make up about 3% of global sales, but that could soon be changing. CBS 4's Nancy Chen explains why. Welcome to CES and to GM's Exhibit Zero. General Motors CEO Mary Barra used the keynote address at CES to unveil GM's plan for e-power, which will eventually include self-driving cars and even flying vehicles. This moment will prove to be an inflection point. The moment when our world's reliance on gas and diesel powered vehicles will begin transitioning to an all electric future. GM, which recently revealed a new logo, will release 30 new electric vehicles by 2025. The e-powered GMC Hummer comes out later this year, capable of going 350 miles on a charge and zero to 60 in just three seconds. The Cadillac Lyric is expected in 2022 and features a high-tech interior with a heads-up display. The SUV also comes with Super Cruise, allowing drivers to let go of the wheel under certain conditions. Down the road, GM expects completely autonomous vehicles and drone-like machines that can soar above traffic. We're definitely seeing a big trend toward electrification. Seen at Roadshow's Tim Stevens says all major automakers are adding electric cars to their lineup. Smaller companies Companies like Sono are offering unique alternatives, including this car that uses built-in solar cells to charge. There's the belief that consumers will start to get on board the EV bandwagon. It's been a little bit slow, uh, but that ultimately that will pick up and that the majority of consumers will want EVs within the next five or 10 years. GM is also developing green delivery trucks for FedEx. The company believes its $27 billion electric investment will power new profits. Nancy Chen, CBS News, New York. GM also has new batteries that can allow vehicles to travel up to 450 miles on a single charge.